Hello everybody. I think today we're going to go trim some of the evergreen trees over along the dry creek line. So gotta trim a lot of those where the where it's grown down close to the ground. So let's get started on that. Let's go get the tractor, get out, and get over there. Ready to get started. Let's get the set up. Like I said, I'm going to do some trimming, trim some of this stuff. What I really want to do is trim these evergreens where they've just grown down to the ground. So I want to trim those to where it opens it up, like that over there, and like that there, and like, like I said, like that over there that over there. So let's set up and let's get going. This one's gonna be a big one. A lot of low limbs there. So that's gonna be quite a bit. So let's see what let's see what I can do to it. Here we go.
got it almost all done. You know, the rest of it's just gonna be fine cleanup, but I wanted to get these evergreens trimmed down. Yeah, that's looking nice. The creek's right down there. I got two more to do right over here. And I think I'll be done after I move all this stuff out of the way and clean it up. Let's go over here and let's do this one now. Or this one, these last two. There's one there and one on the other side. We're gonna do that one. And we're gonna do that one over there, right there. So let's do it. I think I'm almost done. All I gotta do is move all, all that stuff out of the way. Where is it? Right there. I gotta move all that and push it over in one of the big piles. And then I'll be done, so let's do that. For today this is what I've done I've gone through and trimmed up all the uh, evergreen low branches I wanted to open this up let's get this chainsaw and carry it back with me on the way back I wanted to open all this up used to be a lot of these evergreens were grown all the way down to the ground to get out of that glare there. I still got a lot of cleanup to do, just fine cleanup. Rake, a lot of raking. But this is what it's looking like so far. There'll still be may have, still be a few I may trim up some more, but I just wanted to get those big like these here were grown way down to the ground. So I've opened those up. And so I just cut them down. Cut the, Get out of that glare. Cut those branches that are low to the ground, trim those out. Trim those out, this was all just covered. And then when the branches fall, I just, the ratchet rake grabs it and pulls it out. That thing's, you got a tractor, man. This ratchet rake is a neat tool to have. I gotta tell you neat tool to have well worth it so anyway that's looking good one day I may end up getting a, a um, bush hog that I can just mow in here bush hogs a big mower that pulls behind the tractor and it cuts the big stuff so this may be a couple year project next year maybe some the year after that so we'll see it'll take time so anyway, I'm done. I hope you enjoyed that. I bet you did. I bet you just loved it. Don't forget to subscribe and all that good stuff. Like. And uh, we'll see you next time we do a video. I'm not sure which one that's going to be. We'll think of something. Probably the garden. I still got to I still got to burn the holes in the fabric and start getting ready to plant. So let me do that one next. Y'all take care, be safe, and all that good stuff. Bye, y'all.